Animal skins. A slaughterhouse? Nomad, we finally got a 20 on Yuri and Polito. Ooh. The activity cross-referenced the car's GPS with that description you got from the prisoner. They're at a hunting lodge. Rumor has it they use that spot for their enhanced interrogations. Send us the location and we'll take care of it. Put them in the ground for me. Make sure they feel the pain. <sighs> I don't think she understands what she's asking us to do, and I don't think she's thinking right. We've got a location on Liuri and El Polito. Let's pay these fuckers back for what they did to Sandoval. Yep. Oh. These guys gonna get it. Ooh, baby, they're gonna get it. Alright. Back at the beginning. Let's get in and ride out. Hang on, I'll drive. Perico here. And I for one have to admit that though Santa Blanca has been experiencing a boom in the last few years, some recent events are a little bit difficult, right? To talk about it all, here's another message from the man himself, El Sueño. Many of our Santa Blanca hermanos have recently died. I do not blame those of you who have your doubts about our place in Bolivia, about our work here, about me. But, just like Job in the Bible, God and Satan will always test man's faith. With God's permission, Satanás took Job's wealth, took his family, covered his body in sores. But Job did not lose faith. As children, we are taught that Job was rewarded for his faith. That his wealth was replaced, his family was replaced, and his sores were healed. But that is not the book's true lesson. The true lesson is that Job changed his relationship to God, forced God himself to reflect on what he had done to his faithful. Out of this confrontation with God, Job became a new man because God now understood and respected him. As we wage our war, hermanos, as we face our own trials, keep your faith. On the far side of this conflict, you too will emerge reborn as new men, and your divine reward shall be great. The fuck? This dude. Hola, hermanos. Mi nombre es Rudolfo El Jejo. Many of you know me, and I am proud to call many of you mis amigos. Some of you close to me have told you concerns about the cartel. Concerns that I know you Just all watch? I respect the Earth Mother Nuestra Pachamama as much as the rest. Dance on the lodge. Stay I alert. Have my entire life. I have taught disrespect for Pachamama to my children. Quiet, and I don't like that. Booby trap the front door. Walk around. Yeah, I get the feeling these guys are, uh, that door is, that front door has got to be boob, booby traps. Got to be. I'm calling it right now. It's booby traps. Move in. Watch those doorways and corners. Clear the upper level first before we go eat any deeper. I do not want to know what goes on in here. Just 
just... I don't. Medicine? These supplies will buy us a lot of goodwill from the rebels. Okay. This must be where Sandoval cashed in. Bowman said they kept him alive for 47 hours. Tough son of a bitch held out for a long time. I feel like he was waiting for us to come get him, and we're real fucking late. Time to make it right. Water bottles. Cariño. Who were you before you met? Mamacita, I was nobody. Nothing. I could not have even imagined a life so deep, a love so full as the love I have with you. Oh, God, I feel the same. I was half a person before I met you. I was a faded image, out of focus, until I could see myself through your eyes. Damn. Just now, when I was breaking that man's hands, I was imagining that he had tried to touch you. Come on. You're such a jealous man. And each finger I broke was punishment for a sin those hands had committed against you. Mm. Gordo, you're going to make me cry. I can I have a confession. You know you can tell me anything. Uh... anything. Or when you drenched that man with water and I was electrocuting him with a cattle prod? But Irina, that was textbook perfection. Let me speak. After that man had defecated himself because all the pain we had put him through, the suffering, <laughs> a passion like Christ. When he was lying there, whimpering. I almost felt pity for him. I wanted to take care of him. To wrap my arms around him. To wipe away his tears. Stop, motherfuckers! Get it! Oh wow, he's sitting on a machine turret? What? That uh... Thanks. Yuri and Polito have been terminated. You know how in the movies people always act like revenge isn't satisfying? Like it doesn't make them feel any better? Sure. Well I feel fucking great. Taking out that lovey-dovey horror show also earned us some points with the locals. Make contact when you find something new. Bowman out. Yuri is down. First reward, XP and supply boost. Equip new skills, go to Montiolk. Top of us in another few seconds. What do we do? He's down. Terrible. Ugh. Oh, hey, cat. Ugh. We're going loud, my dudes. That's a kill. Alert's over. That'll make things easier. Fuck. We're made. Huh. Alert over! Mm, are you sure? Shit, they're all over the place.
Yeah, time to go silent again. That's a kill. Mm -hmm. There's a helicopter out here. Rally up, people. A copy. Moving. How do I fire this thing? Where's my reticle? How do you shoot in a helicopter? How do you do this thing? Okay, I guess that works. Okay. This thing cannot do anything. Good to go. Okay, come on. Okay, that was... That was weird. So that's how we get through some of that. So, Monte York. We complete all the missions here. We haven't got all the files and all the all the minor stuff. So okay, well then we will save Montioc, Montioc, for another day. We'll come back here tomorrow and uh, let's, you know, finish it out. Uh, but hey, thanks for stopping by, and uh, hopefully we see you guys next time. See you soon.